I'm Darnisha Presley from PSTV. I'm standing outside of the school district of Philadelphia where inside kids from all across the school district are competing in a Scrabble tournament right now. Let's go inside and check it out. Well, you know, we have about a thousand students playing every week in their Scrabble clubs. And so this tournament is a way for them to have like a culminating event and something to work towards where they get to compete with kids from other schools and win trophies and just kind of like represent their school in like a, a, a fun sport, a mind sport. Yeah, it was really fun. I got to meet new people and it was just interesting learning about different words. I liked how it was based on winter words. It was giving me and my partner something else to um, focus on while we were playing. Besides the creative making words and, and knowing your suffixes and prefixes, um, you're also using math when you're adding up the scores, using multiplication, addition. So it's a great educational experience. So it's really like a literacy tool, and you can do it for all ages. Like we have kindergartners who are learning how to play Scrabble Slam, and then they eventually start playing on the board. And then they get really excited about winning, and so they start looking up words and learning new vocabulary. So it's essentially like a reading tool where you don't even realize that you're learning until you've learned all these words. Um, I can learn new words, and um, I can. it helps me with math. The hardest thing in Scrabble is to make a word with clocks. If you don't have a word and you're using clocks and your um, clock go to negative, like you will lose 10 points each minute. It teaches me words and I learn how to count by adding up the scores. The hardest thing about Scrabble is keeping score. Our mission is to develop high quality after school activities and resources to support youth and empower communities in Philadelphia. Well, I think after school time in general really helps with with college readiness because it's like what happens after school affects what you're doing after you graduate in terms of how you're using your time and things like Scrabble you get to be part of a team and you get to do something productive and you also have like really positive adult mentoring relationships in your life when you have a club leader who's supporting you through through this process. ASCP has done a good job um, getting um, children and teenagers prepared for for college and life after college because we focus on mental games, chess, and Scrabble, and they also help um, get us to nationals and states. PSCV would like to congratulate Masterman and all the individual winners of the Scrabble tournament. Remember, this is a yearly competition, so come out next year to support your school. From outside of the school district of Philadelphia, I'm Darnisha Presley, PSCV, out.